hyphenators. In today's tutorial, we're diving into the trendy infinite slideshow effect with multiple videos or images, all synced to the tempo of a song like this one. We'll guide you step-by-step step on how to achieve this stunning effect using the Filma app. So let's jump right in. First, let's add at least 10 different images or videos to a video track that we can play with. Now we have a bunch of clips on our timeline. The next step is to add our music to an audio track. Find a nice song you might want to use and import it to your project. Then drag and drop it onto an audio track or create one while you're dragging when the add new track label appears. Now we have multiple clips and a song for that, but it's still pretty flat. We want to add two key enhancements here. Firstly, make every clip go with the tempo of the song and secondly, make those clips animate with the zoom. In effect, we mentioned at the beginning of this tutorial. Let's go and tap on the timeline ruler, which will bring up the ruler options. We can see how we can select between time and BPM, beats per minute. Select BPM to see the chunks of time for each clip that will go with the current BPM, which by default is 120. Now because we want to match the tempo of our song, we'll need to detect the BPM first. Press the current BPM button to open the detection screen. You can see several parameters here to adjust your BPM. In our case, we're going to detect it automatically, so tap on the Detect BPM option. As we want to detect the BPM from our current song, select the Project option and go to the Audio tab to find our song. Once we select the song, Filma will start detecting the BPM. There we go, we have our accurate BPM. Now let's adjust the clip durations to match the tempo. You can go clip by clip, but there's a better and faster option with multi-selection. Tap on the first clip, then on Multi to open the multi-selection menu. Select the entire set of clips on the current track, go to Edit, and select Duration. The Duration Picker has specific options for the current detected BPM. Tap it, and all of our clips now match the tempo of our song. Next, let's work on the zooming in effect. We'll use keyframes and the scale option. Apply the effect to one clip, then copy and paste it onto the rest of the clips to save time. Select one clip, go to Adjustments, and the Transform section. Select the Scale option, tap on the number, set it to 1 by default, and apply the adjustment. Then go to the Layers drawer. To achieve the zoom in effect, expand the keyframes drawer of the scale property. Go to the end of the first clip, select a bigger value than 1 on the slider, and press the keyframe button to add the keyframe. Now our clip animates from scale 1 to the bigger scale. Check out our other videos about keyframes if you want to learn more about keyframing. We had the effect we wanted, so let's save time by copying this property from this clip. Select the property and tap on Copy. Close the layers, drawer and go to the multi-selection menu again. Select all the clips on the track, but tap on the first one to unselect it, the one with the scale adjustment, because it already has the property added. Go to Edit and tap on Paste Adjustments to add the adjustments to all selected clips. And voila! All your clips have the same animation and we achieved the zooming in effect with music matching in just a few steps. Let's play and check it out. Awesome! That's all for today's video. We hope you found this tutorial helpful and now feel confident in creating the infinite zoom and slideshow effect with the Filma app. See you in the next video and happy editing.